Peggy 3. Welcome to a first look at F1 2010. Hi, I'm Paul Gill, senior producer on Formula 1 2010. My name's Stephen Hood. I'm the chief designer on Formula 1 2010. Hi, I'm Anthony Davidson. I was the Braun GP test and reserve driver from last season, 2009. Uh, I started racing when I was eight years old. Uh, I'm an absolute massive F1 fan. In my first industry job was a QA tester on, on, on Grand Prix 3. Watching Senna and Mansell racing around, they, those were classic years for me that drew me into the sport. You arrive at the circuit, jump in the car, get a feel for it, get up to speed for the circuit yourself. You can pick the game up and get into it very quickly. It's a great level of fun, you're, you're slicing and dicing with the other cars. So we're tailing the car handling to a very different market, to so that dirt too and grid. It's like a, another dream job to have in developing uh, car handling on a, on a computer game. And gives us a lot of feedback week by week. Uh, we've got blisters, we've got marbles, got the fuel coming down, we've got optimum tyre temperatures and ranges. It's got that tension there when you dive into the pits. They have to dismantle the car, take the damaged parts off and repair those. Changing aero on the car. I mean, all that stuff looks pretty cool, but it costs you time as well. The thing that excites me most about Formula One is the access we've got to the, the teams, the drivers, the personnel. It's about making the most authentic experience possible. When you're in the car, you've really got no idea what the web is doing. Uh, we're confident we've implemented the most complicated weather system ever seen in a racing game. We've done a very good job in, in making it look extremely realistic. We're really going to town with the career mode, the challenges that are thrown up at you. Teammate challenge, contract, season upgrades and how the car, performance of the car changes over the season. Those were the things that I want to try and portray in the game, is what happens in real life. Way beyond any computer game I've ever played before. Okay. 